VTR Thames double nine four nine tomorrow people part one take one. switch off the life support system. Have you decided to cooperate? What do you want? Nothing very much. Just get dressed and come with us, then I'll explain. You don't have to, of course. The choice is yours. But if you don't... You murder them. It's all right, Tyson. It's all right, Tyson. My head's ringing. Noises. My face is up. The is getting near the final stages of breaking out. If we get him back to the lab, he'll be all right. Well, that is... Well, I can't stop you, Professor. Stephen, enjoy a little rest. John, what's going on? Later, let's get out of here as soon as we can, shall we? I've got you, John, in both. Professor! Hello, John. Put this belt on, will you? What is it? A matter transporter. Oh, good. I've got a jaunting belt for Tyson. No! It's no. all right, Tyson. It's all right. Put the belt on. All set? Right, let's go. Yeah. Hey. Hello, Chris. Where did you spring from? Well, I heard you were having a spot of bother, so I thought I'd come and give you a hand. I saw that I guess got back to where he belongs using the matter transporters, you said. Well done, Chris. Hey, who's this? Ah, oh, Professor Corston. Professor, this is Chris Hardy. How do you do? Hey, Chris. Welcome, Professor Corston. That's a voice I heard on the telephone. Ah, uh, yes, Professor. May I introduce you to our computer, Tim? Hello, Tim. Professor. Oh, where's Tyzo? I activated his jaunting belt under remote control, but... Oh, where is he? What's happened to him? He is still at the research center. He didn't manage to jaunt. He can't jaunt yet. He's still breaking out. Well, the process isn't quite complete. I've got to go back for him. I'd like to come with you, if I may. Good idea. Chris, give me your matter transport. <laughs> Tizer! <laughs> Tizer, link your mind with mine. Oh, stop it! <laughs> oh, Professor, have you realised you're witnessing something unique? Tomorrow person actually breaking out. Not just a tomorrow person, John. One that I found. What do you mean you knew he was a tomorrow person? Yes, Miss Conway, I did. Professor, would you mind taking Tizer back to the lab? No, of course not. Tim? Come on. Tim. Will you join the professor and Tizer back, please? Certainly, John. two voices that time. I meant you to. Why? Because I want you to know about us, Trisha. To think about us. Because somewhere, back in your childhood, you too were a potential tomorrow person. But unlike Taizo, unlike us, you didn't follow it through. But it's not too late. It's not too late. 